This is Rob March from Clive Edson, Land of Property Auctioneers, and this is King's House in the High Street in Sandown on the uh, east coast of the Isle of Wight. Former bar come restaurant, set over three floors, only too evident from this uh, view, but from the back it opens up into uh, three floors. Quite a substantial building, lots of scope and potential to do uh, good things with this. Maybe uh, perhaps as a nice bar come restaurant or other uses subject to all the required consents that might be obtainable. Uh, staircase here at the side of the property which runs down to the seafront and an early idea of the view from the rear and uh, of course upper parts of the building. So as indicated lots of scope and potential here prime high street location at the front and a lovely outlook at the rear over Sandown Bay. Unfortunately the property does need a good bit of money spending on it in terms of the upgrading but um, very worthy of the works required. So let's head over and uh, have a look at the inside of the let's head over and have a look at the inside of the building so as we come inside the property on what is the lower floor ground floor from the esplanade side lower ground floor from the high street end nice big space here which presumably would have been a dining room leading out onto the sun terrace as can be seen, works have uh, been started here but require completion. A couple of large rooms there looking towards the high street side of the building. As we go through the building, you'll see that further up, the uh, property's perhaps in slightly better condition with works having been started. Some work to be done here to finish off either reopening or sealing off this access point to what was once uh, an adjoining room between here and the next door Ocean Hotel. Over in the corner there one can see the doorway which has been blocked up and which now marks the internal edge of the boundary. So let's uh, move on upstairs and have a look at the property on the first floor. And so as we arrive on what is the ground floor off of the uh, high street, there's the main entrance doors there to what was once the or last, the uh, bar and restaurant. And obviously on the first floor in terms of the access from the esplanade side and example of the uh, views and then heading on through Again, you see we're at street level on the high street. And then first floor level from the Esplanade. Lovely view there over the beach and now towards the here.
And then here on the southern end of the building, we've got a separate access way again. Unfortunately, the windows have been done in, but an idea of the view out over the beach. And obviously, the better views from this end of the building. So that include, concludes our uh, internal tour. Let's head outside and uh, have a look at the property from the rear. And so arriving on the top floor. Obviously first floor level as far as high street is concerned. separate access points to this floor. So outside the property here to the rear it gets a feel for the scale of the property. The uh, sandstone coloured bricks used to support a, a decked area which uh, would have come out from the first floor as we look at the building. And given drinkers and diners at that level, this stunning view. Come over the rear of the property, Sandown View, uh, Sandown Bay, sorry, view of the pier there in the distance, and although pretty full of rubbish and clutter now, this area here, which would have provided a further beer come eating garden for the patrons. And so in summary, we'll be back at the building from the seafront. Gives a good idea of the uh, size and scale of the building. Back down the front there, we've got the relatively new Premier Inn. And back in the other direction, the former Ocean Hotel, which is waiting for some uh, fresh life to be breathed into it. Loads of scope and potential to do something nice with the King's House. And if, as they say, property is all about location, 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 hard to believe there's many better seaside spots available than this one. So uh, don't miss out on this house comes up in the next Clive Emerson online land and property auction. <laughs>